In this video, I open a $150 vintage Japanese jungle booster pack. This pack was stocked on store shelves in Japan when I was six years old. But before we do that, let's warm up with some modern. First things first, we're gonna open 12 packs of Paldean Fates. See if we can't pull a Charizard or a Mew. I already pulled the Gardevoir, so if we could get a Charizard or a Mew, that would be pretty sick before we hop into our vintage Japanese jungle booster pack. Usually, in my history of opening up the these PC ETBs, they're typically not great. In my experience, they're not, they're not fantastic. I don't know why these in particular seem to be not so great, but okay. All right, Pokemon, thanks. All right, just, uh, just slap me across the face. How dare you talk ill of Pokemon Company? Let's just pull a Mew EX right off the bat. Let's get that done. And a Cyclozar. Oh, solid start with the Mew. Let's keep it up. Woobat. Grap locked. Iono. Kilowattroll. Rev of Room. Heat Rotom. Mabostiff. Fido. Haunter. Mime Jr. Noibat. We were talking about Mr. Mime earlier today. It was an interesting conversation, including Ash's mom and some. Cyclozar. Let's go. Namona. The waifu trainer that apparently nobody cares about. I don't know why. Ghastly. Palmy. Look at that little cutie. Little cutie patootie. Barboach. Killwatch roll. Nest ball. Lantern. Reverse mime. Reverse Charmander. Gotta love it. And a heat roll, Tom Hollow. Next pack. Charmander. Rare candy. Trafty. Oh! My boss stiff. Shiny. Barboach, and Annihilate, Woobat, Tandem Mouse, Whooper, Execute, Point Cologne, Primate, Reverse, Armor Rouge, Reverse, Ralts, and Rev of Room. I think Rev of Room is actually a cool Pokemon. I kind of wish that Pokemon would just like send me the Pokedex that they're thinking about doing so I could cut like 75% of the Pokemon and then just add the ones that I think are cool. Although some people would probably be mad at me because my taste is not aligned with apparently the majority of Pokemon collectors. Frigibax, Mankey, and a great Tusky X. Okay. Mankey, Pikachu, Ultra Ball, Mouse Hole. Definitely do not like that Pokemon. Oh! <laughs> Called it. Gardevoir EX. Let's go. Grievard, and an Arm Rouge Hollow. Pineco, Pikachu. Lapras, camera up, come up. Atticus, come up. Glimmit, Chargadet, and Raichu. Fanpy, Jincho, Baroom, Charmeleon, Charmander and Charmeleon. That means, you know what that means? Absolutely nothing. We got a golden go. Last pack of our Paltean Fates. Let's see if we can get a hit to round out the modern part of this opening. Reverse Hooper, reverse Shincho, and a professor's research. Hollow. Pretty decent out of our modern ETB opening, but we did get Mew EX, Gardevoir Full Art EX. We got the Glimmit, we got the Mabostiff, the Palmy, and the Great Tusk. Six hits out of 12 packs. That's pretty good. It's time to open the Vintage Fossil Booster Pack. Japanese. Beautiful pack artwork. We are looking for just about any hollow in the set is pretty good. I think there are a few hollows that I'm not super fond of, like the Magneton and the maybe the Ditto and definitely the Hypno. There are a few that are not so great, but I would say that the vast majority of the hollows in Fossil are pretty awesome. We're definitely hoping for the Dragonite, the Gengar, some of the uh, legendary birds. There's a lot of great hollows. One of the unique hollows in the set that did not show up in the English set was the Mew. So the Mew. That would be really cool to open as well. All right, once we cut, there's no going back. Let's do this. Woo, we're in. I think this pack cost me like $150-ish, somewhere around there. So the hollow will be on the front of the stack here. I am shaking a little bit. Centering is looking a tiny bit off, maybe top to bottom. Not so horrible though. We're gonna set this aside. We're gonna go through our commons and uncommons, and then we're gonna flip that sucker and see what we got. We've got a Mr. Fuji, 
That's pretty awesome. I do think that we have, I think the Grimer is in this set. So the Grimer is a band card. He's looking up a way too young girl's skirt. So maybe we'll pull a band card. Kabuto. Tentacool. Centering is all pretty off left to right on all of these cards. Ghastly, that's a nice looking one. I like that. Slowpoke. Shelder. All of these cards are super off center. Cloister, right after our Shelder. Recycle, I believe that one is. Last but not least, an Ekans. Some of these would have been nice, but the centering is so far off, there's like no chance at any tens for these. So I don't know if I will grade all of these commons and uncommons or not. I have been grading all of the commons and uncommons from the other sets that we've opened, but I don't think I would do these just because the centering is, is quite bad. But last but not least, the centering left to right looks a lot better on this card. So we're gonna see what our hollow is. Come on, come on, something awesome. Oh, all right, we got a Raichu. I'll take it, I'll take it. That's pretty good. Centering actually looks pretty good on that as well. Nice, I'll take a Raichu, that's not so bad. That's not so bad. The hollow on this is crazy. There's so much hollow popping on this. And honestly, there's a swirl on the right, which is sick as well. We've got a nice swirl. That's pretty good, man. I'll take it. 